hello! Today I'm here with a new video and if you haven't been here before, my name is Lisa. I'm a big makeup lover. Big makeup lover. So I do mostly makeup videos and I am a cruelty-free YouTuber. And today it is the big be beginning. It's like I forgotten how to speak English. Today it's day four? I think in my lethal week. I know it's not the fourth day in a week, but today I'm going to play more with my single shades from lethal. And if you haven't seen any of my videos, I talk a little bit more about what I'm doing in my first video for this week. So I will leave it up here. So I have these shades left and I know what I want to do today. So I'm going to pick out the shades I still have in this and we will see if it turns out as I want it to do, it, as I want it to be, goes. And so the shadows I want to play with today are these. This is not normal shades for me to play with but like I swatched a little bit uh, after I did the green and the purple look. That was the last look and I was like, I want to use these. So yes, I'm going to write down here the names of the shadows while I'm doing this. Because I can't remember the names, I like look them. Yeah, whatever, it's going to be down here. So let's, let's do this. And right now I am in a little bit of a crisis. I haven't washed my brushes for a long time and now they are getting so dirty so I really need to wash them. So now I'm like going down to the brushes that I usually don't use that often. But like I just had to take my clean brushes. I guess this <laughs> after I'm done with this I should really wash my brushes. Okay, this might was a little bit darker than I expected it but I swatched it before and I'm like that a good crease shade and I normally don't do like grayish looks but when I did my I've done two looks with the eternal eclipse from Luna Beauty I was like okay I like this So today you are seeing something happening that usually does not happen on my channel. But okay, I do dark looks, but I don't do like grayish looks on my lid. First of all, go in with this one and then this one and deepen it down with this one. I know that you see that coming because that's how I roll. <laughs> So I'm going to start with this dark grey. We will see. Maybe this is more like a true grey than the one I had in my crease. Maybe I was planning to do the other way around now when I look at this. Maybe I should have, but do you know what? You can have a darker crease than your lid. That is totally okay. <laughs> because I'm doing that right now. And okay, I don't know this year. I don't know if it's going to be my pink and my gray year. What What is going on? Do I start to like every color in the world? Maybe I do. So for the rest of my lid I'm going in with this silver and I hope that this brush will work because I do not have any other brush that is clean. And this might be a little bit too fluffy but I will try it. No, I actually think it's working. Maybe it's a little bit too big though. 
I was worried about it being too fluffy, but like the size I didn't care about. This works and... What am I doing? What is this for kind of look? Where have you come? <laughs> I don't even know what to say other than I like this but I don't know need new. I don't know who I am right now. Liking a gray look like this. Who has been taking over me and my channel and my body? I don't know. I'm just going in with matte gray to upper lend this a little bit. Okay, just to match my... So to match it a little bit with... To try to match my eye a little bit... bit. To better match... Okay, I'm going to go in to this darkest one I have taken. Take away the cat hair. And I'm going to take this on my outer V, outer corner, just to even this down a little bit, but not too much. And then up a little bit in my crease. And I see now I want to go in with my crease brush I had with no more colors on it, but... To blend it a little bit here. And the lids are done. I'm looking at myself like wondering do I like this or do I hate it? I actually think I like it. Or do I? I will take away the fallouts and fix my base. I think it will feel a little bit better. And I'm going to do the under eyes. And I'm going to do something with this that I hope will be really cool. Right now I don't know if it's a good idea, but I will try it. Everything always feels better with base on. So, my under eyes, I want to go in with, I think this one. No, I don't think I know. I'm going into this one that I had in my crease and smudge it on my lower lash. And I like never understand people that can have this in their video because this is not how I look in normal cases. I look like this. And I actually think it's enough with only this. I don't feel like I need to take the darker shade to make it more. And for my inner corner, I will take this one. When I did my, I think it was the second look. I took a matte lighter shade in my inner corner. I loved it. <laughs> you loved it. So I want to try it again. But now I want to take maybe a little bit more. And then I type it off like a crazy person. But I hope that this will look kind of cool at least. And this isn't like a super light shade. But I think it goes really good as an inner corner highlight, an inner corner shade. This worked out better than I thought it was going to. So for my wash line, I have no idea. Maybe I want to take something really bright. Maybe I should take this one. This is from LA Girl in Screamin'. I think this is cool to this look. So I will put on mascara and take a lippy. I decided to take a lipstick from Lethal. This is Sanctuary and okay, I love this look. <laughs> it's grungy, it's dark. I got something a little bit more fun in my inner corner. So I'm really, really happy with this look. And All the shades worked amazing. I think I've used all of them except the silver at least once, but so far I think that all the shades I've used 
this week. They are all super good. I haven't found a dud yet, so that makes me really happy. I am so happy with this look. I, I think it turned out really good, actually. And I really hope that you like this video. I think the next one will be a pal bingo. And as for right now, I do not have that many colors left. I got 15 colors left. So I will at least do a palette bingo and then it might come one video more. I will see how I feel. But I really hope you liked this video and if you're not subscribed to my channel, please do. And if you want to know which colors I've used, I will leave them down in the description. And I hope I will see you in the next one. Bye!